Hi everyone and welcome to Calm Creations Craft Tube Floss Tube. My name is Tia. I have another great big little stitchery swap arrive in the post yesterday. This one has come from the motherland. It's come from New Zealand and it's come from the lovely Paula. I haven't opened it yet but I'm very excited. So give me two seconds and I'll open it. flying down, got a little tag, okay, look at that, the dragonflies, okie doke, we've got some washi tape, which we'll carefully open, let's just make sure there's no details, oh my goodness, wow, Right, so that's just the protective card inside. <gasps> okay, so I'll leave that there. That's beautiful. I love those dragonflies. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my goodness. I need to zoom you in so that you can see. Hang on, where are we? That way, that way, down there a little bit. Look at that. That is gorgeous. So, oh, Pahutakawa is a tree in New Zealand. So that says Pahutakawa. The Pahutakawa tree is a tree in New Zealand that flowers in the summer. And it's got, it's like a bottle brush. And it's got these bright red fluffy bits and the little yellow flowers on the end. And they call it New Zealand's Christmas tree. It is absolutely stunning. And we've got some buttons. I need my glasses. Hang on a minute. Oh, that's all thread painted and all the little tiny seed stitches. Oh, Paula, that is beautiful. Look at all of the sequins around that little cluster. That is so pretty. Oh, I just love it. Thank you, Paula. The beautiful blue. That's all sparkly, sparkly thread. And there's the back. Oh, I absolutely love it. Thank you so much, Paula. It will be treasured. I absolutely love it. All the seed stitches. And the metallic thread, and the little Pahutakawa label. That's really, really special. I really do making me a bit homesick. Absolutely love it. Certainly a treasure. Right, now let me zoom you back out again. Yesterday I got a few things from work. Um, just a little bit of a haul. Um, I went snooping through the remnants bin and I found this fabric. So I thought those butterflies would be great to fussy cut. So that's it there. Henry Glass fabrics. And then I got a couple of these. These were on clearance and I thought it was the last two. They're placemats. But I love the old vintage script and the colour. They're just plain on the back, like a canvas on the back. And I thought I could cut those up and make something out of those. I've got two of those. And then I got another trim bag. So in the trim bag, I've sort of had a dig through. There was some pink pom-pom trim, some crochet. Um, trim but this is elastic so that will come in handy for something and then a 
Now these things here, the bag's quite heavy. These purple things are pattern weights. So, and then some little Velcro dots and strips of Velcro, some cord. So, but all those bits will come in handy. So that's my little haul from work yesterday. Um, but, you know, I've started looking at things differently. I mean, this is a placemat. Um, but not going to be used as a placemat. So, yeah, you just look at things a little bit differently and you think about what you can use in your stitching. So that was my thought behind those. But that is it from me today. I'll show you my little beautiful piece again. And um, I will head off now and get this video edited and uploaded. And I will see you all again soon. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.